It was a nervous Walter Gray behind that smile. The results trickling in. Uh, you know, waiting and hoping. Hoping to unseat incumbent Mayor Sharon Shepard, who he lost to six years ago when he was mayor. With 12 of the 13 polls in, Shepard had a slight lead. But in the end, Gray came out on top. It's not like this is a pro-development council or an anti-development council. I believe what we have on that screen there tonight is a pro-progress uh, council, and that's the kind of council I want to lead as mayor. The council Gray is referring to is going to look a lot different from the old, with only three incumbents holding on to their seat. One of the newest faces is former Kelowna Fire Chief Jerry Zimmerman, who topped the polls. I think it's going to be a fantastic council. I think it's well balanced. You know, we, we've got we've got people that are that are of different frames of mind, but um, I know all of them, and I know we can all work together, especially with Walter's mayor. Uh, it's the best leader this uh, city could have. Thank you. Thank you. Sharon Shepard says goodbye to politics, having gone through a long and at times vicious political battle. I thought that uh, the um, the anger that some people portrayed, uh, certainly from Walter's camp, was um, was actually uh, you know I, it caught all of us uh, unaware. The final tally was 13,995 for Gray and 13,574 for Shepard. A difference of. 421 votes, making it one of the closest mayoral races in Kelowna's history. Kelly Hayes, Castanet Media.